Okay, but page I and Tess is min hagim be inyan shkivitz alayva the kids of Yashan al azet zad. Let's look down below. He said we have a little bit of Shefa we'll pick up also. Uh, let's see, where are we? He says, okay, he says, uh, number nun, nun vav. He says, Chavihida betachidus alayva yishkab al zad small. Kanuska be rambam, zal. Uh, uh, so if you want, you could sit on your right side. They say after chutzos. So he says, if you want to. Because of the Rambam, so the Rambam writes in regards to this. He says, Lo yishan adam lo al tzad pane velo al arpo. Ella al Sada Sido Bedahidas al Bedahidas alila ad Sad small of the sofa lila ad Sad Yamin ad Kalashama. Then the Ari sells on this, he says, Shaini and Zecha the Moil the Bata Kokos a Kitsani. The Biosi beer, if you want to get to it more, he's in the Babar, but pre eight Chaim, he says over there, the Zella Shona, the Chatzos Lila Zarisha. Tishan al Sad as small as small is in Isra, as we mentioned before. And then he said uh, he says uh uh he says let me see if I get this right. It uh uh the small is Kanisgar, uh Barambam of the Tov Mao Lahachnia Hakitsani, the Akra Gatsos Yeshkav al Sid of Yomanis, the Ura Rahmin Vasadi. Okay. I had some ideas about that, but I think I got it wrong. Let's see what you have over here in the Chef of the Bonus. He writes here, he says, Hine betechidus alayla, yishkav al tzad small. Ba'achar hatzos layla, im yirza. So he says, im yirza. Lishan yishat lishan, yishapach al yamina. So he wants to say, if you want to sleep at that time. That's what we said. This would be good. What's to say over there? Let's go and see if we can see anything. He says, he says what? Uh, that's what we just quoted the same thing we just read. up until midnight. Uh, who told Maod? He says this is very good. Who told Maod la hachnia hachitzonim? So once again, he's saying the same thing. The nirach of b'shuchul that he had the hachitzonim aim aim a mesitra the small. They really come from the left side. Shuchul a shuchul dinim. But the chain, uh, I thought it was actually the opposite. So he's telling me not, what I thought was wrong. So therefore, when you lay on your left side, it's the idea that you're going to take those denim and you're going to squash them. I guess you're going to you're going to you're going to squash them. But hashkiva of the acher atzos, I'll see the yamanis who matam acher for me is a different reason altogether. Kadei lo orach rachmen v'chasadim diyamin who bepachinis chesed kenaida, which is a chesed he says, which is the right side. Now, uh, now he has another little blurb, and he says, So then he says, So the Shemin Shasasa, he said, He said, But the whole idea is a problem. Hello, his care, Harav Sham Ma'od. She should stay up after her. But she should get up early and start working on the Torah. So then, how are you saying here? He should 
he should sleep on his right side. He said, Rabbi Rav says like this, if you look at the rest of it, that, and so he gives it at times here, really, which is the, the extremely important times about all of, uh, to that time of all of Hashachar. Then he should get up and do that. And then go back to sleep again until you could get close to the time of all of Hashachar. So if you're talking about this person, uh, he said, he says, a cause of comments written right here. Uh, when a person lays down and it's after midnight, now here is a little different language. He says, then in order to, to, uh, squash the, or suppress the, the kochus of the gitzonim, he says, here you, you lie on the right side. The previous answer was that you should, uh, Oh, it's for the purpose of arousing Rachman. Let's go on a little bit more, and let's go to the next one. Uh, I think we're on number Nun Zion now. Let me get something underneath this. So, one second. Okay. Now he says, "Oh, da, he alaylo loves man sitzesu." So he's going into something, something else. Talus, there's a Talus cotton and Talus Gadol is the, so, is the subject here. The Nizka Begamora, this interesting fact here, he says. Um, let me see, we're holding. That's only if you're wearing a big towel. The big towel, the Shem is. Atfim bo bishas and tefila that you put on at the time when you pray. So I think we saw before that the that they're talking about uh, at midchat time they wore towels and tefillin too. Um, so he said the halacha kaim bechol bekaim b'lehem the lila loves a man sits it so. Bolach a rav should davka talis gadol aim the lov should be lila only that one. Ever have a talis cotton yesh the lov shall af be lila. So if a tam who why would you do this? Uh 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 in his voyer explained it with Rosh Hatzitzis, he had talis uh uh vatzitzis who bekinas or amake. So let's talk about it. It's, it's the concept the or amake of nimshach b'tzad ima law el zer anpin anikra midas yom, which is called zer anpin is called the daytime. So the the talis represents. A mida of the daytime says, "Oh, the bracha the nuklet is there on pin on nikvas midas lila." He on zaman shlitas a shlitas. So this is when the nukva is in control. Ain lacha bepachinus or makif misham. There is no or makif over there. Zecha bracha hatam bezecha dehi zecha des boy bedrasha tzitzis. The hatal of the chatzitzis heim bepachinus or makif on nim shecha meim bechay law is there on pin. Anikur Yo, who is called by the name Day, so he's the son, so to speak. Kaven Shuhu Hasholet Biyom. So since he's his shlit is in the daytime, Abba the Nuk is there under the Nick but Lilo. Kaven Shuhu Sholet is the Lilo. Lo Nimshach or Makib Mebechinas Atalis Atzvo. So you don't have that. It's not. It's not shiny. Ela Mebechinas Atzitzis Atzitzio Shalom. The hinder of the talis makif. So what happens? The talif is a surrounding, a surrounding piece. Uh, uh, makif es ha'adam. It it covers or it surrounds the man ad ha'haza until it reaches his chest. Then vatsitzios shemishdalshle shemish mishdalshlos the matav, and then they start hanging down mechahaza. The kaven shemakom amidas hanuk who mechahaza the matav is there anpin. Nimsa she etzim atalas lo mekivim as the nook it never really touches the nook. Rakat tzitzios mechamishdal shudachem olecha so it's only the tzitzios, not the talas itself, that actually reaches her. El misham nimshechas la ha'ara that's where she gets the light from. Aval atalas katan now that's the talas gado which we know that you put it on and you wrap it around yourself. So he said aval the talas katan. And he also has a measurement to it. He says that it, it goes to the chest. It sounds like the old time, 
uh, the old men that came from Europe used to wear these little, little uh, in their shawls, little talises. Uh, but a talus cotton, but the, now the the, small, the cotton which you're lovish during uh, lovish underneath your clothing, the barn is buyer keep zaman It's to tell you that now you're dealing with a time of cottonus. Shahaz has their anpin who mibachinas ya e rukh the glass glue with the cloth. The lachain no the fee the balila, the fee shabalila as za yashin because that's when za za is sleeping. So the Ebor, Shahazah with his Aver, so he comes back into an embryonic state, Beso Kima Ewa, Beso Klas Kluva Beklas, which is that concept which said, which all of this is in the Eber state, or the Eber unique stage, uh, maybe we'll see. He says that it's, uh, it's Katniss, that's the time of Katniss. Uh, so he says, uh, the Katniss, of the Bukhina Ze, Ainer Mizbato, Alfila Bolaiwa. So that particular aspect about it, it's not nullified even in the night time. He don't get talus the bechinas hagadlos who should should nipsa from his bat of a because this lila is a time of cotton as we learned previously or yesterday. I don't know what it was it what it was, but it was that the uh, at light time the mokin that come in are really just the vok of Abba the Ema between uh, Kriya Shema and and the Shemona Esrei. That's when they come in, but they're still only a vok. When when you have the fold up inside of the embryonic stage, it's never nullified even at night time. So he said, so he goes through it. He's going to go through it some more in detail. He says, So it's a, this a completely different stage. He said, "Who bechinas tlas go tlas?" That's so. So, Ima Sha'oz, I'm sorry, read it wrong. The Oz here, the aspect of tli, uh, tlas go tlas. Who bechinas tlas go tlas? That's the aspect of tlas go tlas. The Oz here, the aspect of tlas go tlas. At the high the chashiyesh lo rocks spheres ahadat nai. It only has those spheres. The vera bechachadat bekufo betoch hanai. So the nai covers it over. So basically, you're just looking at a nai. But but they are both there. For the chen yesh lo rock kumas hanai. That's all you see. Vezecha the nikra tlas. So this is called three shuhu chagat. A go tlas shuhu nine. Vezechen a talis katan shiura hu kde a tifas rosh a rosha the robo. So there we say that the talis katan is who is in order to cover over his head and the majority of his body shall katan. So I guess of a small person. Haroma is abba bechinas katanus, which is to tell you that this is the time of mocha the katanus. And what's the purpose of it? And so the katanus is to cover over the chagat part of the body. Shall gadol. I'm not talis gadol who be bechinas or the makif or ha makif shall kabel zer anpin. So the whole idea, the big talis, is that it's a makif. Shall be kabel zer anpin. But he knows that zer anpin is able to receive this when he's there. But godless when he's in a state of godless. Now, he says, uh, there's going to be a little chef on this too, where we have a little limited time. And even after that, when the mochim leave, they call makom nisha bechinas rishimo shal the that there's still a rishimo in the mochim that's left over, call a yom. The levicha the zaman the vishas of talus gadol. Hamam shechachas or hamakiv, which actually causes the extent of this or hamakiv, the zeranpin, the zmanagadlu, who rock beyom, the az who aza who bebechinas gadlu. Amna, but this is what we want to tell you. He says, Amna, but the chinas alayla when the light when the night begins, mistalkim amochem the zeranpin, for who chayz with the bechinas amochem the evening, he goes back into that stage. Well, okay, so therefore. Ain lil vush belayla talus gadol. So there at night time, don't put on the talus gadol. And they call makom talus katan 
Tsar Lilvosh, he says the halacha is that you have to wear it at night time. Mishum Shku Bakinas or Makif, he said, because it's the concept of a Makif, any Welsh is there on pen, but when? Because Shahu Bakatnas, the Bakinis class, Kluva Baklas, uh Kamo Shinis Boyer, as will be discussed further. So let me see, uh really we should be learning uh number Samach and number uh Samach Aleph here. Uh if we I think we might have time. Let's try it. let's try it and I'll come back to the Shefa next time. But the chain la hasef and the holov sits as cotton lo beyond the lobo lila so he said shalo look la hasef never remove it either day or night. Be yishka be mocha belila so lay down with it at night time be yo il ma o the bato koko second sign. Akashin is boyish as man tlalas tlalas cotton who ap belila. Mas here rav shalo la hasef me men of a tlalas cotton call acre. Main beyond the baby lila. So go lay down and sleep in it. There's no time that you have to remove it. Also, only when you're going to go into a position where you're going to have to be completely uh, uh, without clothes at all. Varayal the Dava and Masha Amrach of the Gemara. The Gemara says in the Menachos, he says Shukesh Shukesh Nitnav the Dava of the Merchutz Ra Atzvel Aram, and he saw himself uh, naked uh, without clothes. Amar Oy Li Shani Aram Min Hamitzvos, and he said, "Why?" That's what he said. Ad Shemistako Ad Shemistako B'Mila until he saw that he had a Mila there, which is a, that's the Gemara over there. Which is uh, which is a sign, which is a mitzvah. Even when you don't have any clothes, yashan would remove the mitzvah. There's no time when you don't have to do tzitzis katni. Ella Davka Bemerchatz only in one place where you have to remove your clothes. Maybe Ryan Bedor Abedov in the Mela. Shirak Beesi Yusech Bebeis the Merchatz. How are we doing here? We're out of time. The uh 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 Doig Alki Yusech Bedor the Mitzvah Bedor Bedor Bebeis Mishkav Lishan Lo Doig. Why wasn't he worried about it? That then the uh the Oz Alki Yusech Bedor Bedor Mitzvahs. He said, "Mukosh hoisu do eze mitzvah shakayim gam be eze shenasno be shenasno when he's sleeping." Val karko shahoyim mitzvahs sitzes. Therefore, that is what you need to do, and that's according to the rabbi.